this is it. Mm -hmm. If they come here, we're flying over there. That's that. Baby, why you came? Popses, back at you with another video. I'm Megan. I'm Brianna. And this is a different kind of video today. <laughs> SB19 is nominated for a BBMA. Yeah. It's so exciting. It's very big news. <sighs> the more I think of it, it just it feels like it's that first day of me finding out again. I found out as soon as it was released out into the public. I was watching the video live. I probably should have recorded a reaction, but most of the time I don't do reactions without Brianna. And she was in school, so I was running my morning errands and then I pulled over to listen to that part and I like cried in my car for a long time. <laughs> and I was like screaming. <laughs> and yeah, if anybody was like nearby, they're probably like, what is happening inside of that car? It was me <laughs> having a mental breakdown in a good way, but yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, there's no reaction videos to us finding out, but I can tell you we were definitely both super excited. I told Brianna after she got out of school because I figured if I told her during school, it would distract her for the rest of the day. Yeah. So. I answered my phone during class. What? What did you what? say? <laughs> this video is exactly what the title shows. We are going to try our best to help you guys that may be feeling lost or may feel like you know what you're doing but you want to make sure you're doing the right thing for voting. It can be a stressful time but we're here to maybe try to ease that stress help 18 out. Yeah, that's why we're here. So BBMAs, we have voted in the past for BBMA stuff. We didn't do last year, but we did the two years before that. Mm -hmm. And it's been since K-pop, so we got to vote for our favorites at that time, and it was very interesting, yeah. BBMA voting is different every time, it seems. So that's why something that you will see here is the voting in itself, we're not completely confirmed on how it's gonna work, but we'll get to that. Man, the nominees for this year. Those are some amazing groups. Yeah, I agree. All of these battling against each other. It's gonna be insane. We love all these groups. So most importantly, right now, we have to wait for the official statements, which is how much we're gonna be able to vote, how we're gonna be able to vote, and how long it's gonna last and when voting ends. And to be able to find these statements, you can always find the BBMA's Twitter account their official Twitter account that should be announced on there however they have a lot of other stuff to deal with with the BBMA so if you're wanting to know specifically SB 19 18 how we can place our vote for SB 19 you can follow a variety of fan sites and fan accounts on Twitter the ones that come to mind SB 19 trends is always like my go-to that's where I get my tags and everything from if you are in a GDM that keeps up with this kind of stuff that is kind of in the loop of how this stuff works you can always talk to your admin for your GDM. These GDMs can be just randomized GDMs or GDMs specifically to your country. If you have not found one of those on Twitter, definitely go find your country. We have all sorts. Twitter is going to be a huge key in this and we'll get to that. Try to find your country if you can, if you're not placed in a GDM yet. If you by chance do not have a GDM that you are a part of and you would like to be a part of one, you can always reach out to Simu and I will put their account down here. They will help you with placement for a GDM. That's good news for everybody that's needing a GDM. And you can also like make a ton of 18 friends in GDMs too. So. Definitely reach out to Simu if you are not in that placement, even if you don't need the information if you're already, like, say, following SB19 Trends, you can always still be in the loop whenever you have other people talking about it in a GDM. Some of the countries I know very well, of course, US18, which we are a part of, that's our fam, we love them. <laughs> Honestly, you can always follow US18 too for information because US18, I know the admin, I know you, and I know they're watching, y'all stay on top of it. And and I'm proud, proud to be US 18. So there's US 18, Canada, Hong Kong, Germany. There's so many different kinds, yeah. So definitely find the group that's best for you. You can always reach out to see me and they will help you with that placement. 
So right here on this chart are the time zones for when the voting starts. If by chance your time zone is not on here, I would say use one for reference that you are familiar with and adjust it to your time as you need to. Like we said before, we do not know when the voting will stop, so we have to be vigilant to make sure that we are ready to do everything that we need to do as quickly as possible. After voting starts, we will know for sure how to vote. We will know when we can vote until all of that fun stuff. So we have to wait for the official statement like we said before. So make sure you're waiting for the official statement to really get more of a clear picture on how the voting process works. Unfortunately, this is all we have at the moment, but we do want to make you aware that there are ways to keep in the loop. So make sure you're staying in the loop for that. It's going to be really, really important because we don't know. We could have as little as 24 hours to vote. We would never know. So to receive any more new information out of all the social media platforms, Twitter is the key to all this. Yeah, Twitter is going to be super important for staying in the loop for all of this. Twitter is also possibly, don't quote me on it, going to be one of the ways, if not the only way of voting. But we don't know that yet. So that's what I'm saying. Don't quote me on it. I'm not saying it officially. I'm just saying Twitter is going to be very important in all of this. The BBMAs have proven time and time again that Twitter is pretty much like their outlet. They haven't officially said that, but it's where you get a lot of their information most of the time. Even after they released all the nominations for the BBMAs as a whole. They did what is called Twitter Spaces, which is just basically where a bunch of people get together and talk over audio. It was a lot of official people for Billboard that were talking and speaking on there. They were talking about the nominees, what had them excited, things like that. But they did that on Twitter and it was exclusively on Twitter. So Twitter is going to be very important. If you're not on Twitter, if you're not crazy about Twitter, that's okay. But if you want to join in for the voting, it's going to be very important to at least be in the loop. So if you don't have a Twitter account or you have an old Twitter account that you don't use anymore, make sure to create a new one or log on to that one and make sure you stay active for at least 24 hours so that you'll be able to vote. Yes. Having an active account is just kind of a safety precaution. Nobody has officially said this, I don't believe, or I'm not entirely sure. But you do want that account active so that it is maybe at least somewhat recognized, if that makes any sense. You'll want to maybe post something, uh, retweet a few things. You could always just go and retweet some stuff from SB19's official account, which I will put that right here if you are new to Twitter. Another cool thing that maybe you are unaware of, if you're totally clueless to Twitter, all the guys have their own Twitter account. If you get on Twitter and you need this information, you're completely new, tag us and I'll put our handle down here. You can tag us to let us know, hey, I need this information and I will write out something that shows you SB19's official account, all of the guys' official accounts, things that you should maybe consider following and this is not paid, we're just mere fans, so yeah. These are the things that we use on Twitter regularly to, you know, stay in the loop. On the topic of social media, I can't 100% say if only Twitter might be used or even will be used for voting. I saw a post about this, so I'm not 100% sure if it's true, but I did hear that there will for sure be no voting or anything with TikTok. I don't know how true that is. Let's wait for the official statements and then we'll see from there. So the last and final thing and something that we wanted to add is to avoid any distractions on social media. This is common. <laughs> when there's big things that we have to vote for, the haters really show themselves. It comes out and they will try to distract a lot of you from our goal. This is a short window possibly that we have of voting so we cannot let those distractions get in our way. If you see the hate that is posted for whatever, anything about SB19, ignore it guys. This is just important for Twitter in general. It has been a problem in the past of being like what's called a Twitter stand. This has been a huge problem in the past because people will respond to those hate comments or whatever, hate tweets about SB19 or you know, whatever it may be. These people want attention guys. That's just basically what it boils down to. People that troll like this, they want that attention. So 
whenever you respond to it, you're giving them what they want. And on top of that, if they're doing it at this time, they're probably doing it for the reason of distracting us from our goal. So don't let it get to you. Let it pass. The best way you can get back at them is to give them no attention at all. Block them if you have to. If you're in a GDM, you can say, hey, warning, block this person. It doesn't even have to be during voting. It can be any time. So if you see any haters or people trying to troll, just have the mindset of, hey, step aside, warn your fellow 18, and just keep going for the goal. Yep. That's all you gotta do. Yeah, it's really important because we don't know how much time we have with this. We need to make sure that whatever time we have, we use it as wisely as possible. A big thing here guys, don't stress over this. Don't lose sleep. Please get your sleep. Please eat. I know that you guys really want to work really hard, but SB19 would not want that for you. So make sure you're taking your health into consideration too. It's very important that we, you know, stay healthy throughout. So please make sure you remember yourself even on all of this. Let's just, we'll just try our best guys. That's the best we can do is just try our best. We'll try our best. SB19 knows we will try our best. They'll see us try our best and it is enough. So don't be discouraged in any way. Just try your hardest. Something that's huge about 18 is this fandom just works so well together. We have systems of the way we do things and so many people that, you know, work really hard for trying to make sure that things go smoothly and make sure that we're getting all the right information and getting it as quickly as possible. There's just so much teamwork in the 18 fandom. So let's just work as a team, guys. Do what you can as an individual. It's a big deal that SB19 was even nominated in general. Even if we don't get that win, this is already huge promotion for them. Just them getting nominated in itself is a huge accomplishment. Make sure that you are taking that accomplishment as it is and trying your best afterwards. I hope we covered everything that we could. We tried to take as many notes as possible and talk to somebody that is working very hands-on with this before making this video. So hopefully you got the information you needed. If by chance you do need to go to the comment section and ask further questions, definitely go down there. I will try to answer what I can, but the best way, honestly, the best way to get your answers is to head over to Twitter or ask them on Twitter and you can tag us in it. I will try my best to get to as many of those tags as possible because I don't know how how many are gonna come in. It could be a lot or it could be a little. There's no way of knowing yet, but I will try my best to make sure that I'm staying on top of those. The way we have to end this video is to say a huge shout out and congrats to SB19 for this nomination. This is so big and we don't have to tell you. I'm sure you know. <laughs> this is huge and we're so excited for you guys. No matter how this ends up, nothing but amazingness can come out of this. We're really excited for you guys. If you come to the U.S., we're ready. We've been planning on this. <laughs> oh, the thought. Oh my god, the thought. We will literally fly over there. We will. Yeah. We will. This is it. Mm -hmm. If they come here, we're flying over there. That's that. It's SB19 in the U.S. Like, we have to be there. We've been prepared in case of this emergency. Yeah. So. Yep, so much exciting things coming for SV19. We're so proud of you guys. Keep working hard. We will keep working hard for you. Stay strong in all of this. As far as 18, we will get reactions out soon, guys. I know you're waiting for the wet dance practice and everything else. We're not ignoring this stuff. We've just been really busy. We weren't planning on making this video today. It's Mother's Day. But we know a lot of you have been asking us questions, so we were like, let's try to do what we can. We'll do our part make a video. Let's do our best, guys. We can do it. We got this. We got this. Yay. Well, we hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to our channel down below. Click the notification bell because we do post often. And we will see you next time here on k Bye. Just tell my rules of his cock, no crap.